Hello, guys. Vanilla. So, I what I'm trying to get at in these tutorials is just to show you very basic stuff. Uh, how to spawn in items. Um, there's still a lot of things that I don't exactly know. Uh, what to do, how to use them. Say if there's a CTF banner. I'm still not quite sure how to, uh, for instance, go up to a flag and, and pick it up. I'm still figuring out things like that. Um, sword. Uh oh. There we go. So let's uh, say like a sword. I'm still, I will not be able to show you yet how to make this sword equipable from the ground. Oh, that's kind of, it doesn't have any texture to it. So in that event, let's apply a texture to it or a material. Um, that's kind of interesting. There we go. So I'm not sure what kind of sword this is. Uh, let's just like apply, I don't know, this to it. Uh oh, oops, I double clicked it. See, that, that doesn't line up at all. It looks ridiculous. Or say this, maybe that'll line up. No, it doesn't. Somewhere within. UDK, there is a material instance constant that will line up with this sword, but whatever. Um, there's sword sounds like sword. Beams. This is all applied for. Oh, that's kind of cool. This is applied for actual. Equipable weapons within the game But anyways if you want to like say just decorate the outside of your golden box with uh, I don't know a few hound swords. Oh No, that's a texture Whoops hound Skeletal Static mesh. Nope skeletal mesh. Nope. Uh oh long sword I want to find that sword. A uh, long sword. Static mesh. Oh. Yep. 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 Is this it? Yes. That is it. So I want to take it. Let, let's see. Let's see the size of it first off. See how it compares to my beautiful mason body. And you can tell by that in third person. Damn, this thing is tiny. So. I would. Oops. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. I want to scale this thing up. That's probably pretty good right there. And I want to lean it up against the wall. Now just, just a thought I'm having. If you're used to map editors, like say the Far Cry map editor, which is what I was expecting out of UDK when I first started trying to figure it out, it was a complete disastrous nightmare comparing those two because they're completely different they have I guess nothing in common I'm just placing my pivot point there so that I can rotate it from there anyways turn off my grid snapping and make it rest right against the wall cool got it spawn in Come over here. Go in the third person. Looks pretty rad. Now I want to say. Notice how the pivot point went back after I reselected it. Just be ca be uh, aware of that. I want a whole bunch. And perhaps I haven't tried this yet. Perhaps I can replace it with another uh, mesh. So say like the arbiter. I select it, I go down to replace with, and uh, definitely not, that didn't work. 
That's a static mesh. It should replace the static mesh. Okay, here we go. There, cool. Move it up a little. Awesome. Um, this one I would like to replace with just the default longsword. Replace with. Eh, not working. Still not working. Maybe I gotta. There we go. I guess you load first and then, you know, replace. Cool stuff. Cool story, bro. Anyways, that's decorating your golden box with three swords. Hope you enjoyed that.